Alright, I'm gonna do a little review of Mario and Sonic at the Olympic Games. So, it's got all these different game modes. But options, that's just like changing the settings. Records, like your personal best, you know, whatever. Gallery, like crap you've unlocked and you can see like, learn more about the Olympic Games. But single max circuit and mission are gonna be the three main game modes you'll do. But, you know, the single play is, or yeah, single match is just so you jump in, you know, and you play. Like, just do, you know, real quick. You can have one to four players. You can have four, one, two, three, whatever. So, I'm doing gymnastics, uh, trampoline. I'm going to be Luigi, because, you know, he jumps pretty well. So, you can look at the controls, or you can just go to the event. I would just go to the event, because the controls are pretty basic, and it actually says on the screen right there, right there to the left of Luigi, there. And you can just move the Wii mode up and down, and eventually, when you get high enough up into the air, you'll have to press different button combinations. And the thing, that last thing you saw right there, that just means you shake the Wii mode. So, yeah, you know what you're doing. You get the point. Let's go back to the main menu. And I'm going to show you circuit now. And circuit, you just... It's just like a continuous event. I'm not going to actually demonstrate that. So, like, beginner's class, free circuit, you know. But mission is, like, the main story mode you would be doing. Pick a character. Different characters have different things they do. Like, for instance, some swim, some run, some throw, some shoot. But... You want to get a star on each event so you can unlock more. So I'm just going to show you Javelin Throw with Knuckles. And go to event. You shake it. Get the speed locked in and chuck the Javelin. Now, I would recommend renting this game before you buy it, because you might not think it's that good, and you might get frustrated with the controls. So, yeah, you just throw the javelin. So, I'd give it, like, a 8 out of 10. So it's a pretty good game. It, especially if you have multiple people. But, yeah. It's my review, because it's... It's... Boom.